Hey, I didn't think you were coming. I changed my mind. I thought it'd be fun to spend some time with your children. Where are the little scamps? Scamps? I'm sorry. Tykes, rugrats. What is the PC term these days? What's going on? Oh, we were in the bookstore, and I found this. Experimenting with babies. 50 amazing science projects you can perform on your kid. You can't experiment on his kids. You're not their father. You can't experiment on my kids. Oh, fine. Can I at least play a game with them? Perhaps. How developed is your peripheral vision? Mine's great. I saw that. Listen, you secure them both in car seats and slowly spin a toy at the end of the string above them. The younger baby tends to reach with either hand and the older baby prefers the dominant hand. That is kind of interesting. It's not really experimenting on the kids. It's more like experimenting with the kids. Well, I guess if you think about it, it's kind of like playing games with them. Okay, you know what? When they wake up, we can try one or two of these. Oh, <gasps> yay! <laughs> I said yay! <laughs> I, I bet Michael grabs it before Hallie. Not a chance. Hallie's a year older. You know she's going to get it first. I just think he wants it more. Come on. Come on, you got this. You got this, grab Michael. Grab it, grab it, Hallie. I believe in you. Don't, that was so, so close. Just keep on trying. Hey, 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 you guys want to make this more interesting? By establishing a double-blind protocol so we have a foundation to publish? Yes. <laughs> okay, you want to engage the babies. The subjects. The babies. Uh, fine. The babies. Baby A and baby B. Engage them for a minute and take note of their reactions. There's something familiar about all this. Okay, go. Hello, baby. Are you having a pleasant day? Oh, my God. This is my entire childhood. I... <laughs> Leonard, Leonard, you're tainting my data. It's like word for word. <laughs> How much time is left? 35 seconds. Oh, really? He's not reacting at all. Sheldon, he's a baby. That's not how you talk to him, okay? I got a dud. Let's switch. <laughs> Keep trying. It's for science. Is that all I was to her? Just an experiment? <laughs> Michael. Michael. You're making me look bad. Hey, interact with me. Oh, he grabbed my finger. Oh, he's smiling. I'm doing it. <laughs> That's time. Oh, really? Can we do one more? I think these guys need to get some food. By pushing a lever at the end of an obstacle course that we designed? <laughs> no, by opening the door to a hangar and letting the airplane fly in. Well, you were right, Amy. There were so many valuable experiments to perform on them during bath time. You don't say. <laughs> I do. I tested their object permanence with a rubber duck, and we took a run at Archimedes' water displacement, but that went right over their heads. Well, I'm glad you had a good day. I did. It's so funny. We did all these experiments on them, and they didn't even notice. Spending time with Michael and Hallie today really made me think about our future children. Huh. What an interesting and completely unforeseen development. What are you thinking? Well, I just can't decide. Either five sets of triplets or three sets of quintuplets. <laughs> you know what? It doesn't matter as long as they're healthy and divisible by three. That's a lot of babies, Sheldon. Oh, only for humans. For frogs, it's just a drop in the bucket. <laughs> well, I'm sorry I'm not a frog. Oh, don't feel bad, Amy. You're good enough for me. <laughs>